at seventh in the world, but second in Africa with two gold, zero silver, and one bronze. Meanwhile, South Africa finished for the second in the world, but third in Africa with one gold, three silvers, and two bronze. Moving on, not like the experience in the just concluded Olympics, Nigerians will have the cause to smile when the 2024 Paralympics commence in France as 24 athletes are ready to embark on a training tour in Germany. Nigeria has participated in every subsequent edition of the Summer Paralympics, though it has never taken part in the Winter Paralympics at the Tokyo 2020 Summer Games. Nigeria won 10 medals of 4 gold, 1 silver and 5 bronze, bringing the total number of medals to 80. A total of 24 athletes drawn from four sports represent Nigeria at the private 2024 Paralympic Games. The sports include para-athletics, para-badminton, para-powerlifting, and para-table tennis. The contingent will depart for Germany in two batches. The first batch will move today on the 12th of August, while the last batch leaves tomorrow on the 13th of August 2024. On the Bryce and Odis, head coach Rana Wakama has been named the best coach in the women's basketball event at the 2024 Olympic Games. Wakama led this digress to the quarterfinals in the women's basketball event. The African champions defeated world number three Australia in their first game. The West Africans also recorded an impressive win against world number five in their last group game. Wakama's side, however, bound to the eventual champions USA in the quarterfinals. The digress made history as the first African team, male or female, to reach the quarterfinals in the history of the Olympics. Now to football on the home scene, Paul Onwachu and the special press from Southampton manager Russell Martin. Onwachu joined the Saints after spending the last season on loan at Turkey Super League at Fit Transosport. The Nigerian international made his first appearance with Southampton in over a year against Getafe on Saturday. The forward future remained on Saturday, with Transosport still keen on signing him on a permanent transfer. Martin's praise the striker for his professionalism. Quoting him, he says, I just think he's different from what we have. He trained really, really well. He's a different player to the one I came across in terms of confidence. I think the last preseason was so difficult for so many of them. End of quote. Onwachu has made only 11 appearances for Southampton since he joined. Moving on to Lua Rokudari was on target for the second consecutive game as KRC Gang defeated Champions Club Bridge 3-2 in their Belgium Pro League clash yesterday. Gang fell from 2-0 down to win the Kelly contested game. Arukudari equalized for the 07 minute from time. This one the 3-year-old was also on target in their 3-1 away loss to 08 Lauren last weekend. He was in action for the entire duration of the game. His competitor Jirasso was also in action for Gunk in the game. So replaced Christopher Bash in the 24 minute from time. Super Eagles midfielder Rafael Onyedika also featured for Club Rouge, where the car was in action for 64 minutes. You're almost there. Just get the diaper from the shelf above the TV. Okay, I think I got it. Yes. Are you sure you got it? Maybe I should come home. Relax, love. It's okay. I fed him. He's smiling. I'm just happy you could stay on the call for this long. I hope I haven't finished your airtime. Oh, it's fine. I recharged using NCN and Wolf for you, and it gave me a whole six times airtime bonus. So we can talk as long as we want all day long. Enjoy a wolf that makes sense with MTN a wolf for you. Dial star 888 star recharge pin hash for six times the bonus on your next recharge. You can also use the Momo or the My MTN NG app to recharge. Terms and conditions apply. What are we doing today? Is your heart racing because your MTN line is blocked? You can't make calls. You can't receive calls. Not even text messages? Nothing at all? What about bank alerts? <laughs> all these happened because you haven't linked your NIN to your MTN line. Unblock your MTN line today by linking it to your NIN. Rush to any nearby MTN store or agent. If you don't have your NIN yet, no problem. Simply go to any nearby NIMC office to get your NIN. MTN. What are we doing today? And now to football in Europe, Manchester City avenged their African final defeat to Manchester United as Pep Guardiola side triumph 7 6 on penalties after the community should have finished leveled at Wembley. But the receiver cancelled that Alejandro Gennaccio's goal to put the game at parity before going into penalty shootouts. Now threatening to escape, he finds Fernandez somehow, who in turn gives it to Garnacho. Two waiting in the box, Garnacho allowed to wander! It's a terrific finish from Alejandro Garnacho, and once again, Alejandro Garnacho has put Manchester City on red alert! Getting away from Martinez, and there is the birthday by Bernardo Silva, stunning Manchester United, 
with one of their first real effort and Silver Service does the damage. Akanji against Anana. Akanji wins it for Manchester City who start the season as they mean to go on. They win the Community Shield for the first time in six years. To some interesting preseason matchup over the weekend, Liverpool manager and slot first game at Anfield ended in a comprehensive 4-1 victory over Sevilla. Slot is taking over the red following the departure of Jurgen Klopp and inside went into the game against the La Liga team on the back of wins against Real Betis, Arsenal and Manchester United during a preseason trip in the United States. Jogu Jota opened the scoring while Lizard scored the brace before the afternoon break before Pique Fernandez put one back for Sevilla and 17-year-old Liverpool substitute Trey Noni added the side sports with a smart finish. Meanwhile, Chelsea manager Enzo Maresca was also taking charge of his first game at Anfield as the Blues ended the 1-1 draw with Italian champions in Milan. Maresca replaced Mario Pochettino at the end of the London side in the summer and he had forward Cole Palmer and defender Marco Curella available after their return from Euro 2024. Both played the pass in a game with Marco Sturam gave Inter the lead before Leslie Uguchuku equalized in the final moment. Chelsea also introduced new signing Pedro Neto to their fans at halftime with the Portuguese forward joining for an initial £51.3 million and a possible for that 2.6 million pounds in add-ons. Arsenal have also finished second to Manchester City in the past two seasons, running off their preseason campaign with a 2 0 win against Lyon. William Saliba and fellow defender Gabriel both scored with their headers from Declan Rice's corner in the first half. Italian defender Ricardo Cagliafori, who had joined the Gunners from Bologna this summer, made his first appearance for the club when he replaced Alexander Zichenko in the second half. This is where we call it to wrap on today's edition of Sport Trip. Keep listening to us on Lagos Traffic Radio 96.1. I am Oluji Midari, saying stay sporty, stay healthy.